Hi everyone, my name is Tab Morgan. I'm going to do a quick unboxing of the Atomus Ninja Flame that I just received yesterday. Sorry for my uh, scruff, I have a wedding tomorrow and I'm going to be using it on it. <coughs> so I will give you another update on how it looks, how it works tomorrow live at the wedding, which should be up in a couple days. But when I opened the box, I thought there was stuff missing from it, from what I was told from my connection to Animus. So I figured I might as well make an uh, unboxing video for everybody so you know what you actually get in it. <clears throat> Comes in a big box like this. It came wrapped in plastic. Um, on top of this, there is this little black box underneath it, right here, it says US in the bottom corner and what's inside that is two power plugs with USA connection standard plug that we have a million of them laying around the house from everything else that we uh, use here okay there's two of those that are in that box I don't know why they put it on the outside but I guess depends on where the unit is being sold. Has these little rubber foams on the bottom. Like I said, it came with a plastic wrapped around it, which I opened it up and I charged the uh, batteries that it came with. Much nicer case than the uh, Ninja Assassin, which I also own. But we have here, let's open it up. And this is being filmed on my Sony A6300, uh, which I also got about a week ago, with the 18-105 to 105 lens and a little Sennheiser shotgun. So I apologize if the audio is not perfect, along with my beard, which I'm saving to shave for tomorrow's wedding. It comes with, take a look there, and you think that that's all that you get. It comes with one, two, three, four hard drive caddies. Uh, actually five because there's one extra one that's in the um, card reader that it also comes with back like the Ninja um, Blade back in the 1080 days. It comes with two medium size uh, NPF batteries which are 5200 milliamps so it's like the medium size Sony NP. Uh, F and PH um, comes with underneath another single to double I guess for audio um, I think so you can split it so you can listen and monitor at the same time here's the actual assassin it's got looks like hard rubber nice feel to the edges all plastic not like the uh, Assassin where it had that rubber around the edges Where it's uh, always whenever I twisted my ball head underneath it always twisted the um, The rubber and it's it looked like crap basically you have on one side. We have an earphone jack. We have a Audio in out XLR mic Jack the on off button on this side See if I can give you a closer view there um, on the opposite side, we have a little remote pinhole and HDMI in and out, if we can take a look at a better angle like that. Um, feels nice weight, has vents on it. On the reverse side, we have here the caddy slot for the hard drives, and you have two battery slots for the Sony uh, batteries that we can put in, if I can get it lined up right here, that's one, let's get it here, that's two, come on, there you go, two batteries, fits nice, little weight to it, so not bad, and you got little quick release buttons right here on the edge to release the battery back there and this is where 
it goes awry because when Adamus, my connection, oh, it's got another, looks like a remote or power connection jack right here on the back. Um, I'm pretty sure it's a power jack. Um, when my connection at Adamus sent me a picture of what's supposed to be included in the box, I'm like, well, I'm not seeing half of that. And then I thought of the Ronin where it has a double layered foam. And then I started to wonder, but there's no handles on this one. So there's no way to actually pick it. You got to start digging and pulling it up. And I just messed it up already to get it open. Now you have that top layer. Now on the second layer, we have Ninja Flame Quick Start Guide that we can play with and read. A sun shade, a strap for your shoulder for the uh, case, a P-tap, D-tap power cord that we can uh, use a, a, a big, huge battery size. Looks like two quarter 20 screws, which are probably for the sunshade to screw it on the top and on the bottom. Do they have the extra quarter 20 holes inside of it? Yes, where you screw the sunshade on with this and then you still have a quarter 20 hole, female, to tap something else. I don't know if you can see it there. Angle it, there you go. So you can uh, still attach extra stuff to it. We have, looks like two separate chargers where you have the one, looks like a better quality charger where it's got LED lights. Four red is charging. Then it gives you, I guess, 25, 50, 75% and then all green, 100% charged. Take a look at that. And then it looks like we have two charger adapters where that's where those two plugs came into right there over there and then we got the other power adapter and let's take a look because I think they're probably both the same yeah both plugs look the same they look like they're identical units Okay, so that's everything that we got in here. Nothing in the back. Nice case. I think it's a lot. I personally like to have everything streamlined, but I guess if you need everything on location, you can have it. Um, I like just the monitor to take with me on a wedding. I'll be shooting a wedding tomorrow, so I will give you an update uh, as soon as I get back and have some behind-the-scenes footage of how it actually looks and what the quality is. I'm hoping that it's supposed to be awesome from all the specs. I'll let you know. Thanks.